Hey y'all, a lot of you guys don't know that before I actually got my braces put in, I had to have a lot of work done to my mouth. Um, your girl had a couple of cavities. I also had to have a deep cleaning done. I also had an old root canal that needed to have a porcelain crown put in. Yes, this video is about braces and porcelain crowns. I also, prior to the dental work many years ago, I have a porcelain crown right here in the front of my mouth. And the other one is in the back right here. As you can see, there's no bracket on the one that I have back on the side of my mouth. For the simple fact of when my general dentist put that one in, he put it so tight, like it's so snug that my ortho said that there was really no movement that was gonna occur between the teeth that was on each side of that. So he didn't feel a need to put a bracket there. But as you can see in the front of my mouth where my porcelain crown is, I have a bracket there. It hasn't come off. Um, before they actually put my braces on, I asked so many questions about um, what type of glue you're gonna use? How strong is the adhesive? Because I was afraid that the texture of a porcelain crown is different from the textual texture or the enamel of our regular teeth. So I didn't know whether or not it was gonna stick. And then I heard so many different stories about other people saying that they had porcelain crowns and when they got their braces, their brackets were breaking off every week. But Thank God that's not my case. Um, my bracket hasn't broken once. Actually, I've been in my braces for 11 months and I have yet to break one bracket, TMI, because nine times out of 10, me saying that I'm gonna end up breaking a bracket. But what I am thinking about doing is, since the one in the front of my mouth is many, many years old. I'm thinking maybe about eight to 10 years old. Um, and it was done by a different general dentist than the one who did the one on the side of my mouth. The one on the side of my mouth is so pretty and it looks so much like my regular teeth. I'm thinking about having the one in the front taking out and replaced before my brace treatment is up. Because I'm thinking about if I get another one and it's placed in and it's not placed snug properly. I may end up having to get braces over again if I get it done after um, my brace treatment is up. Your girl is saving up right now for, for the new porcelain crown. I wanna say that I paid 1200 for the one that was over here on the side. So I'm thinking that the front one is going to be the same thing. I'm going to check the next time I go in for my cleaning. My um, end date with my braces is supposed to be, I think, September the 22nd. So I know I need to make some decisions. So I wanted to say that if you're out there and you're thinking about getting braces and you have, a, you have porcelain crowns in your mouth, it's most definitely okay for you to have them done. Just make sure you ask questions knowledge is power and to me there's no dumb question the only dumb questions that are out there are the questions that's not asked don't be afraid to want to know about what you're paying for and what's happening to your mouth so at your ortho like what type of adhesive that they're using on you um will it be strong enough to bond to your porcelain crowns and if it does break the first time, give them a second try. If you need me to ask my ortho what type of adhesive that they use on my porcelain crowns, reach out to me and I'll make sure that I do that for you at my next visit. So I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about um, porcelain crown and braces because I have gotten a couple of questions about it. But a lot of people look at my mouth and they really couldn't tell that um, I have porcelain crowns unless, you know, you know me from childhood and you know what my 
teeth looked like before I actually got the porcelain crown placed in. So thank you guys for listening to me tonight. Thank you for tuning in. And I would like for you guys to like, comment, subscribe, share your girl video, support me and I'll support you back. So until we meet again, see you later.